What's good, Homer Squad? It's your boy, Homer Zabie. We back here with another reaction for y'all. And we here with Cam Steady with his Rayquaza song, Sky Pillar. Official music video, but it's mostly AMD. But you never know with Cam Steady. At one point, he'll find a way how to do like, you know, at the there was like this one section or so where at one point in the nerdcore scene there were there were certain people doing like the AMV slash face reveal and such so and hey Camp Steady was definitely one of them who was heavy heavy on the mostly face cam like and such so really showing their face and such so hey and look at the end of the day whether they showing their face or whether it's the AMV at the end of the day all that matters to me personally is how the song connects to it because either way it will be fire so and it's been a little minute since I've reacted to a Cam Steady song so or the last one I reacted to was his cypher but like for a Cam Steady song song can't remember well no look it's been a little minute since I reacted to a single Cam Steady song alright so we better check this one out Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. <laughs> Follow me on all my socials up there. And without further ado, let's get loud. Cause I know that's how he's gonna be. First of all, this why this sounds like it's like a freaking marching band type vibe and such. Hey, one thing with Cam Steady, he gonna make songs that makes you wanna freaking rage out for shit, sure. But hold up, this sounds like it's a freaking orchestra. Now, let me cl clarify myself. The last time I reacted to Cam Steady was when he did the rap battle and such with. Deox versus Rayquaza and he was Rayquaza and Matt Foyo was Deox so I was figuring he was probably going to do because the way how he was going crazy with Rayquaza I figured he would do like a Rayquaza song so hey let's get it hold on shout out to Zeppelin I make a heathen believe in the, the I make a heathen believe in the divide. Mm. Rayquaza, I'm riding these streams, streams like water wave, but like, yeah, yeah, like water wave and such, but also streams like song streams and such. And hey, Cam Steady will ride these streams and such, nigga, forgive me. how he's like da, 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 da. The, this is why there's always that key point of always knowing how to ride the beat of a song cuz it's one thing where he's just screaming and such but the thing is here's the difficult here's how where when it comes to Cam Steady and Peso Peak Peso Peak will find a way he will he shows the ways of how he can 
you will fit into that little pocket so and so right but he'll do his t but you will know he'll do his like unorthodox style of making it sound like he's offbeat but he's supposed to be but he makes it feel like it's just make it be fired nonetheless right where he's offbeat but he's not offbeat right with Cam Steady, the way how he does his screaming, rapping, such, where he'll make sure he follow the rhythm of a beat and such, and not a lot of rappers can able to like. There's a few rappers and such that can be able to do that type of screaming rap where they scream so loud, but they can be able to make sure it connects with the beat and such. And hey, Cam Steady is def Cam Steady is definitely one of those rappers who he can do it, and plus. Mind you, this man, and I saw on Twitter where he was, like, talking about who would be, what what two connections from, like, the nerdcore and mainstream could collab together. Me, myself, I say Cam Steady and Suicide Boys, because a lot of Cam Steady style kind of is the same thing as the Suicide Boys. So, Cam, if you've seen this video, let me know if you agree with me or not, because I see that you said it's Denzel Curry and such, so, hey. To each his own, but I, me personally, I go with Suicide Boys. But enough for me yapping back to this. The freaking ad lib. How you make the ad lib be on beat too, nigga? What the fuck? Like, nigga. Hold on. What the fuck? Bro, that is just the bounce of how this is. Like, like I'm saying, with Cam, he'll give you that type of vibe where, or just that's the thing where I love where, with the beat and such. I'm not saying you can't rap. Rap you, rap your ass off if you want to rap your ass off. But make sure you're still finding a way how to flow with the beat, cause I don't want it, cause. Honestly, let's be honest. You can rap good as much as you want, but if you're not trying to still connect with the beat and such, it's gonna be off for me. Cause I don't want where I'm hearing good rapping and such, but you're not like trying to flow with the beat and such, like flow with the production. Cause you want to make sure you and the, you, you you vocally and such, and you would and the beat and such is like one. Make it feel smooth and such and the way how Kim always does it and many other rappers whether nerdcore or mainstream or whatever that's what I'm always loving where the lyrics are fire as well but with the way how the flow and the cadence is where you're matching up to the beat that's always gonna that's always gonna touch touch right there in the music for me and such And then he he gonna switch into a peso p type of vibe where he gonna do his unorthodox vibe, bro. But the thing is, you 
I don't want to say it's biting or anything because these are they're two different types of unorthodox styles. Peso is pesos and this and Camp Steady is Camp Steady. So I won't ever want to hear about nobody saying this person is biting this, this person is biting this because to me honestly, yeah they may be paying homage and such but if you actually look at, if you actually listen to how one person do their type of style and the other person even if they're paying homage to that style but you see how they do their style to me, I would not call it biting. Not one bit. Because at the end of the day, it's different. They're both different in their music. That's how I look at it. Yeah, that's a good way of how you end this song off. Just with that. Because it wouldn't. That's the thing with Cam. And that's another thing where I love with Cam Sandy songs. Where his songs make it feel like, nigga, these should be performed. Basically, with how the NPCs are and such. These definitely. He makes sure he wants these songs to not only be fire on the playlist but when it comes to playing them on stage oh he finna act an ass and such but hey man shout out to cam man because trust me <laughs> when it comes to the rage types of vibe and such in nerdcore i always love going to cam i ain't gonna lie with y'all but it's been your boy homo ziggy signing out stay positive keep the vibes up and make sure you hit a like on this and such and hit that subscribe button we're on the road to 3k so hit that subscribe button but I'm out.